back if you see a duck. Hello, Mutant. I am M. Night Shyamalan. I will be pooping. I will be popping in and out. That changes the whole sentence. Popping in and out. I have a doctor's appointment in an hour. Hey, oh, sup, Big Mac. Hey, guys, hi, Estonian. How's you, Mossy, and you, Big Mac? Uh, sup, Crow, Quack Rock. I'm tired. And no, it's Shama Ian. <gasps> Zach, Big Mac, Estonian, how's it going, guys? How's everybody doing? Obviously, Zach said what he's feeling, but how are, how are you other two people doing? Nah. No, Shama Ian, that's what I said. You have a headache? Nice. Not really. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully, uh... You're able to either hydrate or maybe eat something or maybe you just need some extra sleep or maybe you just feel coming down with something. Sorry to hear you have a headache, man. Like Shaman from the game. Doing okay, I had a little stomach flu thingy, so I'm tired. That sucks, Estonian. Was it Corona? Sorry to hear that, man. It's cool. I'm still, man. I hope you, uh, whatever, whatever remedy you find. Ian, like Shama Ian. We're ta we're saying the same thing here, man. All right, guys. Mutant Year Zero. Um, yeah, man. Uh, we, uh, I guess we're marching to Eden or whatever. When last we left off. Did you have too many Ronas? Ronas? What is a Rona? I hate, I hate you. I love it every time, dude. Every time. First you give me a duck rock, and now you ruin my joke. This game looks crazy. This game's cool. I, I, I mean, if you like uh, x commie type stuff, it's cool. I'm feeling better already, but I haven't slept good the past two nights, so I'm sleepy. Estonian? Sorry to hear that, dude. Hopefully you get some good sleep tonight, man. Corona the beer? Oh, I've, I don't think I've ever heard them called Ronas before. I actually didn't fall asleep until 7 o'clock in the morning last night, so I'm a little tired myself, but I'll be fine. I'll get over it. Estonian, I hope uh, whenever sleep finds you, it is nice. I hope Odyssey crashes the next 30 times you try playing. Yo, same! Should've played D&D. &D. Nah. I just was... I just wanted to delay in bed. Try and fall asleep. Which is a battle I lost. All right, we are. What are we doing here? What do I want to get done here? Welcome to the fix pit. No, we don't give a stalker discount. Oh right, I just did that. Um, right, I just did the devil camp, the horn devil. We lit. We just cleared that out. That's where we left off. Um. Yes, I'll I'll commit and make this a great weapon. How about See ya. that? Great weapon, man. All right. I hurt my toe. My toe. Oh, Baldur's Gate 3 got a gameplay review yesterday. It looks good. I should uh, look at that. See what it looks like. Shotgun. Shotgun's pretty good. As is. I didn't feel like it needed a super big upgrade personally. All right. We have the Grave of the Ancients and this. And then probably this. 
I think we're really close to the end of this game. Like, well, maybe not. Maybe, maybe you know what? Maybe not. Maybe, maybe let me not assume. But there's only this appears to be three areas left. Guess who's back? Hi, ladies and gentlemen. Ogre. Ogre. How jet lagged are you? How's it going, man? How was your Disney trip? I kept stubbing my toe and it caused it to become ingrown, so I think... I think, but I cut off the skin and it was hurting. Ow. And there was blood everywhere. I'm going to post it in the D&D &D chat if that's alright. Yeah, go for it, man. Go for it, Estonian. Ogre! South America's twinned with Cleveland. I, I saw your unfortunate um, interaction. Sorry to hear that happen, man. But uh, some people are just rude regardless of race. You know what I mean? What am I doing? Oh, yeah, I was looking at this. Oh, right. I don't have enough. I'm so jet lagged. I believe it. I like how it's the whole of South America. I know. All right. Let's get in here. Let's just see what the Grave of the Ancients has in store for us. That's the biggest wall I've ever seen. It's surrounding the entire city. They were trying to keep people out? Trying to keep people in. The Red Plague oh. started in this city. It spread fast. Got out of control. So the powers that be built a wall around the city to quarantine it, to stop the people inside from infecting the world. Oh, Doomed them all. I'm stuck. That was a long time ago, but people are still scared to go in. That's why they call it the Forbidden City. If the plague is still floating around in there, I don't know if we should go in. Hammond said the Nova Sect were moving around the city. We cut through the city. We get to Eden first. Yes, all of them. Well, that's not even reasonable. <laughs> what character you guys, you guy play in D and D? Uh, I normally DM. I, I like DMing a lot. But in the one D and D game I'm playing, I'm playing a 67 year old human man named Adari. He's a paladin. That's my one character right now that I'm playing. When I play Ogre's D and D game in the future, I'm gonna be a Dragonborn Druid. I'd be forgetting something? What am I forgetting? They all look the same? That's not even reasonable either. <laughs> big fat, oh, big fat juicy cock. Yo, duck cock and all that nonsense because we're not kid friendly. Everybody throw in. You know what? Never mind. I'm not going to know. No, no. That's inviting so many. That's inviting problems. It's going to say everybody throw in something non kid friendly, but I'm going to refrain that. Uh,. As long as it's reasonably and does, as long as it's reasonable, it doesn't get me banned. How about that? Or get yourself banned. Oh, Robo. I may be racist. <laughs> All right, just a bit. I'm playing a barbarian. I play the annoying furbolg named Born and a no named Winston and a no named Zerwin. Same, and his name is Shump. And a gnome named Rester. Oh, and a wizard goblin named Randolph. Ogre! Buttercup. Eventually, Ferg. I actually just got done um, last night while I was awake and not sleeping. Um, I just finished up writing the next session for oh my goodness the next session for the stream and the next session for um, the other game that I'm running uh, well one of the other games that I'm running do you like gnomes my monk Goliath he's Ferg Luke is playing a gnome named Winter Zali I'm not really playing a gnome right now <laughs> You're starting a new campaign tomorrow. That's pretty dope. 
Yo, that's pretty dope, man. How big is the party? This thing is beefy. Wow. Ah! I almost killed it in one turn. Oh, it stunned the- Yes! 50% chance to stun is amazing. I love it. 50% chance to stun is awesome. That's so nice. Follow me. Only deep gnomes. I crave sleep badly. Well, get some sleep, man. Baldur's Gate 3 video on Discord enjoy. Hence the quotation marks. Four, maybe five? Nice. I'm arting a camp starting a campaign tomorrow if anybody wants to play. D D? It's a joke. After our hard work has finally started to bear fruit, Central Command has cut our project. Effective immediately. Those ignorant cretins are afraid of what wonders we have accomplished. Under the cover of night, I gathered the surviving young and we made our escape into the zone. We are heading to an abandoned facility which remains unmanned since the war. I shall not let my magnum opus be destroyed by those fools. All right. This guy definitely, if he's trying not to sound like the bad guy, he's doing a really bad job. Like a really bad job. Not the funny, I created machines, a character. Like the one we saw by Hammond's cabin. I made a bunch of characters the other day. Well, I made a bunch <laughs> of NPCs the other day. I used to make them on these spreadsheets on my computer. And uh, I had I had like twenty or so NPCs via spreadsheet on my computer, and I was like, I don't want this anymore. I'm gonna just change all this stuff. So I just put everybody on D and D Beyond. <laughs> Ooh, yay! Scrap. When Ogre's campaign happens, I'm playing a bugbear barbarian named Ronk. I don't know how I'm gonna kill that. Oh, there's a ladder. Okay. See these burn marks? Someone gave this thing quite a shock. There's a ladder. Ah, start a new life off world. Miramar is offering places in our luxurious orbital facility. Oh, this is the first time this has ever been brought up. For science, we offer unlimited research possibilities. For the brave, we can provide off world military training outside of Earthbound mor uh, morality regulations. For the fertile, we can provide the most advanced pre- and post-natal care. Using the tool provided in this kit, submit the following to be considered for a perfect life beyond the stars. Looking forward to shaping brighter futures together. Huh. First time I've ever seen anything like that come up. Interesting. Ogre Lucas tormented one of my characters. What do you mean? Come on. Torment is a strong word. I take I take offense to that. Guess whose pre-order of Two Point Hospital arrived while they were on holiday? Mine? Was it you? Yes. Also, it's on Game Pass. Glad I have Game Pass. It keeps happening to me. What is Two Point Hospital? I keep seeing it. First you blew off his arm and then you introduced a duck that's actually a rock. 
I don't know what you're talking about. I got called out. Austin and Austin and um Well Austin called me out while we were at D D on Monday. Um Austin was telling uh Nate our DM about the campaign he was doing on stream, his solo campaign that we started. And uh he was like Luke took away all of my back he just took all of my stuff. He just like took everything away from me. And then Nate was like, didn't he do that at the beginning of our campaign? Didn't he take everything from us? And they both were like, wait a minute. Why do you do that? I got called out about it. It's like, I don't know. I'm sorry. It was just, it was, I just did it, okay? It's not a thing I want to do. It just happened. I'm sorry, all right. Also, we, uh, we challenged the DM. We challenged Nate. Me and Austin were like, okay, can you, like, hurt us for real? We want an encounter that's gonna hurt, so I'm sure that's coming at some point. It's a hospital management game. It's basically theme hospital. It's very good. Yeah. I guess I'll look into it. I guess I'll look into Two Point Hospital. Something I could potentially be interested in, maybe. Although I am playing Assassin's Creed 2 again, again, again. I got into that rabbit hole last night. Uh oh, stinky. You are whale cum? I sure hope I'm not. I'm going to be honest. That would make my life very uh, unfortunate. Also, I think I'd be much heavier. Well, I don't know if there's any way to go about this without alerting everybody, so... Let's just start with the police. Oh, man, there's so many things. Is there a med bot? I don't think it matters, right? Because they're all non-organic. This is an old quarantine outpost back when they thought they could control the spread of the Red Plague, before they built the wall. You think our world's garbage? Their world was a nightmare. Oh my. starting to look real good Oh right now, my. It? Let's keep moving. Oh my gosh, there's so many robots. Holy crap, there's so many robots. Okay. I'm laying Dead Space 2 and 3 again, heavier and stickier. I'm playing Ace. AC3. What made you want to play uh, Dead Space again, Ogre? Oh, man. Oh, also, Estonian, if you're not asleep already. Um, how'd the continued playing of this go? Have you beaten it yet? I guess I'm gonna attack the mirror murmur first. But real quick, I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything super cool. Doesn't appear to be. These people couldn't escape their own city. Trapped in here with the plague. Doesn't appear to be anything extra cool. This is kind of, you know, normal nonsense. I haven't played it in a few days because I haven't felt great. That makes sense. That makes the most sense. Not sure. It was just in my games list and I just started it. Nice. All right, I guess I'm gonna. Uh, I'm just gonna start with this guy and see where this takes me. Bam. Nice, okay. Both of them hit, and I think we stunned it. We did stun it. I might come back to that. I may not attack that, actually, then. Oh, 
If that thing is stunned, I'm gonna try and take something else out. Still great games. BRB, no worries, Zach. Wow, that's only a 75%. There we go. It's not worth it. I won't get the kill. Okay. So I'll just sit here. Um, I think I'm going for it. I guess. Not what I thought I was going to do, but now that I'm here. I'm at my folks, so I shall have to lurk BRB. No worries, dude. You do what you got to do, man. Enjoy your lurk. Oh my gosh, that hurt. That was nine damage. That really hurt. Oh, I forgot they could do that. It's been a few days since we played this, so. Getting back into it. Oh, and I crit. That hurt, Borman. Are you for real? Okay. Uh, I guess that hurt Borman. If I'm not moving, I might as well reload. Don't. Hey, that was a crit. back for a bit. Rip audio. Just kidding. I thought forgot. My Bluetooth was on. Never mind. All right. That was a roller coaster. That? It was a roller coaster ride you took me on there. Hashtag yikes. Wow. He got the high ground from that. Nice. And Borman's stuff. And Borman's hurt. How do I have no chance to hit? How does that make sense? Ah, oh, I didn't get the kill. I found an issue with AC3. Unsurprised, uh, they free the free run doesn't always let you run. Borman is still up. Look at him, he's a legend. Borman is a legend. It sometimes just stops you. The remaster graphics look very Dishonored-ish. Okay. Whatever you say me. Ah, uh, we're in a bad position here. It's almost just in a bad spot. There's no way around it. Nah, man, he is the legend. I don't think I want to move her anyway. Because if Borman goes down, I want to be able to heal him. Speaking of... Oh, man, this is a problem. This is a big problem. I don't know how to describe it. Oh, the character models and the cutscenes look kind of play doh -y? I don't know how to describe it. This is a problem? This is one of those things they call a problem?
I forgot how much of a BA Hatham is. Problem. Man. Go! Oh, they got him. That sucked. Was really hoping they wouldn't. They got him through the floor? Ah. Oh. I got a stalker in the room. Even more not kid friendly. 25% chance to hit's not very good. But it destroys cover. So ultimately it will give me a better shot. Uh, I gotta move, man. I gotta go get Barman. How can they see me? I don't get that. How can they see me? Aren't I under wood? I guess not. I guess the wood ends. No matter what, she is in Problem Town. So, yeah, no matter what, they can see her. So, just go there. You are resisting arrest. Remember, kids, suicide is badass. Yep, Danny agrees. Oh, one of them's coming down. That's generous. Right Less generous. Silent. No chance to hit. Like that. All right. Uh, you're gonna med kit Borman. No. Oh no. The high ground really screwed me here. Uh oh. Uh oh. I, I gotta go get him, and I'm gonna get killed, I think. Oh, he caught it! That was awesome. That was awesome. He didn't catch that. But the high ground. I, I know, it was bad for, for me. Relax. Let me tell Woo, Borman's up. He is out of ammo and everything. He's going to reload. Borman, you're going to get Selma up. This might sting a little. Oh, interesting and efficient. Interesting and efficient. Okay. Man, they can just see me wherever, huh? Oh, I have no chance to hit that. Well, Selma can move, but is there any, she doesn't get any cover anywhere. None of this is cover. I can put her here, but that's still not cover. Ain't nobody got cover. You know what? I'm going for it. 50% chance. And I hit one of them, so I would have... Come out, it came out the same as if I had not done that. Oh, uh, Selma's up. Oh, Selma's not up. You gotta make me down. Have a 
nice day. At least they're not rude about it, I guess. All right, last med kit. Let me help you with that one. Much appreciated. Dang, they ripped through me. Nice, and I got a crit on it. Uh, at least one of them is a 75% chance. Oh, it doesn't matter. Even if I don't move, it's still 75. Nice, I knocked him down. That's awesome. I think I got to go for the kill. I think I got to move her and go for the kill. There's no, yeah, I have to, I got it. One less person shooting me might save somebody's life. Comply. 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 I missed! I missed a 75% shot! Um. Unfortunato! Ah, uh, that might actually have not worked out in my favor. Uh, my, my doctors, I gotta go. Be back in a bit. Good luck. Yo, Zach, enjoy your doctor. Damn, I gotta reload. Oh, Selma's down again. Now the virus is down. I am just standing out in the open, but still. No, Borman, you did not. Borman. 75%. Don't miss. Okay. We did it with much struggle. With much struggle, we did it. Whoa. All right. Let me get another health for him. Let me get another. Health for Selma. Okay. I have a recurring dream. In this dream, I I go into a place bathed in white light. I feel at home there. Home. I have a recurring dream. In this dream, I. Oh, dialogue is I repeating. Place bathed in white light. Whoa! Twenty-one weapon parts. Feel at home there. <laughs> Funny you say that because. I had the same dream once, I think. It was a bright place, humming with machinery. In that dream, for a few minutes, I felt safe. This has to be useful. Nice. Oh, my goodness. Destroys cover, knocks back enemies. Powerful enclave weapon, rumored to be from Eden itself. Sometimes seen being carried by tank ghouls. All right, that's cool. It's a cool gun, I'm not gonna lie, it's a cool gun. You're not the only one. It's a dream, that mutant's dream. Maybe it's our memory screaming for attention. Telling us to go home. To our true home. A cool the little guy. don't want us talking about these things. The Ark is home. End of story. And right here is our Fast travel. Well, I got through the city, so that happened. I thought that would be bigger. I'm not going to lie. I thought that was a bigger area. Oh, no, there is another area after this one. At least one more area after this one. Interesting. At least. Could be another area after that one as well. Also, I need to go get some med kits. Just gonna throw that out there. And potentially switch out some stuff. Wonder what the max level is in this? Yeah, I don't know. I would assume 99, but I could be wrong. Also, I don't know how you would reach 99. Unless you just fight a ton of things here at the end. 
Since this game doesn't have um, respawning enemies. Oh, Come now on. we're in the city. Danger ahead. Oh, we weren't actually in the city. All right, well, I'm going back to the Ark real quick. I'll go back to the Ark real quick. I'm gonna see if that gun is better that I just picked up, and I need to buy more med kits. Um, and obviously I can see about other upgrades and such. Since I haven't been using my scrap to buy anything else, I'll use it on med kits. Because, wow, you know, that battle we just did really hurt a lot. You defy oh, yeah. Hi. You defy your elder. I told you not to go through the Forbidden City. The city is a tomb. The Rat Plague poisons its air. Strange beings patrol its grounds. Perversions of the ancients. And still you go. Still you seek this ridiculous Eden. There is no Eden. Stop this foolishness before you get yourselves killed. Okay, man. The Ark thanks you for your service. Be well. That's a little different than what you were just saying. Welcome. I didn't figure we would go see the elder. If you want zone gear, I've got it. I figured we would not do that, but I guess we did. Bye. No matter what the elder says, there is life beyond the ark. You see those giant machines floating in the sky lately? <laughs> Where do you think they come from, huh? Okay, so we got this thing. Destroys cover, knocks back enemies. It's 1114, naturally. Foreman's gun is 1015. Yeah, it's, this gun's better. Take it easy. Yeah. I'm gonna put that thing on. This has more range, but when I take off the um, equipped things, I bet it won't be as good. Is this one just as good or not? 1014 and this one's 1015. And this one has a little bit more range, but I'm about to take off all this stuff. So it's probably not better. Hi. If you're here to pick through my dad's stuff, it's been picked clean, okay? But if you want a fix or an upgrade, talk to me. Uh, so I'm going to add 30% to the range, and I'm going to add the two damage to the critical and disable. Now it's 1116. Now it's 1217. This gun's really good. Donates 10 bits. Please show feet less than three. Hawaiian guy, you're purple. Hawaiian guy, you are purple. What, what made that happen? That's a big gun. It is a big gun. You're not wrong. Uh, okay, I think that's it for now. Take it easy. Pabs! Zombies! Hey, Hawaii and the show feet guy. Hi, all. Hey, Sam. Hey, Estonian. Hey, Sam. Sam, what's going on, dude? How's it going, man? Welcome, welcome, Hawaiian guy and Sam. Well, let's get in here with our... Are better. I think that's a shotgun, I'm gonna be honest. Or it's like a grenade launcher, but I think it's a shotgun. Does a lot of damage. 
Really? That's a lot of damage. Same joke. Hawaiian guy, thank you for the host. Not much nice, dude. Pretty sweet Taki. That's some pretty sweet Taki mushrooms. Okay, here we go. The Forbidden City. Nope. I guess maybe yes, because it's the only way I can go. Let's just try to get through the city peacefully with no trouble. What? Whoa. No termination, okay? Woo. I don't think they're talking to us. They're talking to the people who died here. There's a lot. Oh, there's something back there. Oh, man. There's a lot of stuff here. I didn't buy any med kits. That was the thing I forgot to do. Did I not get friendly? Yes. I forgot to buy med kits. Let's see how this goes. Why 50%? Why 75%? Oh, god dang it. Okay. Well, let's just see what we get done here. Oh, I stunned it! That's so handy. Um... I had a new donut chicken sandwich from KFC. Yeah, I saw that. I saw your tweet. It's got some. That's all right. It's got some okay range. It's also got three shots, which is nice. Ah. Unfortunate. Can I hit the guy up top? Nope. Can you hit the guy up top? Really? That seems odd. Well, that'll free Borman. Who can then... Do this, and then... Good shot. I missed one of those, somehow. Selma... That's no chance to hit? Really? That's no chance to hit? Man, okay. I'm gonna go here. How can that guy above me hit me? Yeah, I'm gonna go here. Oh, I didn't realize that guy overwatched. Did you see the Borderlands 3 roadmap for the upcoming months? It's an awesome, yummy mess. Nice. I did. All right, that guy's dead. Selma. Selma's literally standing next to the guy, so twitch shot. Oh, 
Okay, both of them hit. Nice. Oh, and I stunned it! <laughs> yes! I love stunning. I love stunning robots. That's so nice. Oh, can I really not grab this? Can I grab this gun that's leaning against the wall? That seems like a, a waste. Seems like something I should be able to grab. Something is back there. Something big has a flashlight. Also, I got Borman was like, let's try and get through this without attacking. All right, man. Do you know who we are? You know what we've been doing all game? Well, let's see what we got. Oh, maybe it's not something. Oh, maybe it's a drone. Oh, no. No, no. No, it's something big. Woo! It's tall boy. That thing. And it has a pulse. It's one of those machines we've seen broken all over the zone. Except this one is fully functional and probably not friendly toward trespassers. We stand little chance against this enemy. Caution dictates that we find a way around it. What? This is horrible. Look at all these bodies. Are you for real? I know that they've said that before, where it was like, we don't have any chance to beat this thing. Those are some advanced machines. But really, though? Do we not? Be Even with all my firepower, we don't? Y'all watch any anime? I don't. Not anymore. Um, although One Piece is my favorite show of all time. Seventy. You know what? I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I want to see what this thing does. I'm going for it. Got it. We stood no chance against it, they said. They, we stood no chance against it, they said. Uh-huh. I do not, I tried two times, but I haven't gotten into them. Fair. I, uh, I would like to watch some stuff, but I just, you know, I only have limited time with my day. So I have to pick and choose what I do with my time, and I'd rather play video games. Hey, over here. I mean, if I had unlimited time, I'd watch a bunch of stuff, but I don't. Another Mimer machine, the biggest one we've seen yet. Wonder if it fell out of orbit, maybe. That's a lot of robos. I need All to catch back up with One Piece. With beards must be a come by an animal. Yeah. Always goes trouble. This is the first time in my life I've ever like fallen behind in one piece. It takes a lot of time. Yeah, man. So it's just there's not enough time in the day to do everything you want.
Oh, there's a robo over here with the big guy. There's a couple of robots over here with the big guy. Ooh, there's a lot of robots over here. Okay, there's at least three and that thing. And then we, we saw four or five more on the other side. Dang. I gotta make a choice. Do I just go for it? I'm going for it. I've already made my choice. I'm going for it. See what happens. Nice. All right, somebody can get into Overwatch. Yeah. That's a shot, isn't it? How is that not? How is that not trigger Overwatch? How does that not trigger my overwatch? He's like right next to me. Oh, that's so lame. All right, that's fine. Do I think there are a lot of robots in the final area? Probably. No chance to hit thing, it makes me sad. I don't see how that's no chance to hit. I have a straight. I guess high I guess high ground is way more powerful than I'm giving it credit for. Did we stun him? No, but we did, we did knock him out of cover. Ah, it still doesn't really help that much. This is a 25% chance to hit somehow. I guess technically he's still in cover, but still. I missed. All right. And, uh, let's try and get this kill. The quicker we kill things, man, the less things we have shooting at us, obviously the better. Oh, nice. This thing is probably going to start heading this way. And when I killed that thing, the two drones died. I don't know if that's because it exploded next to them or if it's that's like the hive mind. But uh, we'll find out, I guess. You do not have a shot. That sucks. This will put her in cover against the robot and give her a 100% hit. Oh, it stunned him. That's nice. I can now reposition a bit. I can reposition a bit here without worrying about uh, losing a turn. That guy does nothing, but this thing is coming. 
Oh! I'm sorry? Tech, 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 tactical nuke inbound? Um, tech, tactical nuke inbound? Let me push him into that and uh, get the heck out of here. Like, get out of here. Selma's in it. Let's deal with her first. I don't know what the radius of this is. I'm scared. J just run. Just get get out. Just run. Um, I'm gonna put Borman here, assuming he's going to be safe, because he's not in the lasers. Crap. No, Selma's not in it to win it. She's in it to to get killed. If she stands there. I'm assuming this will not hit anybody because I moved everybody out of range. It's got its own cutscene. Oh, okay, it did hit Borman. It has a splash damage radius. Can it do that every turn? Okay, it didn't do it. Technically, I think they're getting high ground. Alright, we have got to kill this thing. Without a doubt, that thing is a priority kill. As much as those drones are hitting me with damage. I stunned it! Yes, it's so good! <laughs> the stun is so good! 50% chance to stun! He caught it! Yo, Magnus is the best. Magnus is awesome. Now he's gonna have to heal, probably. Get out of the way. I want your boss. Yes! Okay, so it's like a hive mind? If you kill that, you kill the two drones as well? Or they were just close to it and it exploded again? I'm not sure. I'm assuming it's a hive mind because it's happened twice now where both the drones died after I killed it. Which would make shooting at the drones useless. And all of my uh, attention should go to the big boy. Dang, that is loud? Whatever that is, it's loud. Also, I think there are more tour of the forbidden city ends. enemies. Well, yeah, I, there's our exit, but hang on. I, there's more enemies over there I want to get rid of. You know, I want to kill them. They're, they're in my way. I don't want them to be alive. 
I'm still also missing, um... I'm still missing one more artifact. There's one more artifact somewhere in the game, and I haven't found it yet. Robo Shack. Could be interesting. Robo Shack? Could be a shack of killer robots. Is this Detroit become human? That was a fun game, man. I didn't know if I was going to enjoy that, but I really enjoyed that. Oh. Are you not an enemy? Oh, there it is. Commode 64. Nice. Got all this stuff. Apparently, big with a group of civil rights protesters called the Demo Scene, <laughs> this box has clickety buttons and makes some nice sounds when powered on. This immediate persecution. Pretty sure these were a form of ancient message. Are you really not visual, deadly? As there are ancient letters all over the buttons. Are you all deadly? Are you guys really not deadly? You're just friendly robots? Oh! Up. Oh, okay. Now they're in it. Hey there. Okay. Sorry. I picked up the artifact, so I thought it was fine. Oh man, I picked up the artifact, so I didn't think that was a problem. I didn't think it'd be a problem. Oh okay, yeah, that's fine. Oh, Selma, what are you doing, girl? Why are you downstairs? Ah, oh, man. Oh, that was awesome. Selma's just downstairs. She's not even up here with us. Destroy all robots. I'm going for it. I'm trying. I'm making an effort. I will do my busy best. Nice. Oh, I didn't knock him. I thought I knocked him off. How did... Alright, you know, fair? Really? I don't know how you missed, but you did. Is that it? Oh, I guess I don't fight the other ones. Nice. I guess these ones are not fighters. Cool. Tea leaf. Yeah, steal something from Robo Shack. Okay. You say so. All right, let's go here, and then I'll probably head back to um, the Ark. Because I, I got to give that guy the uh, last artifact thing so that we can upgrade. And I could potentially upgrade some of my guns and stuff. Which, you know, is always a good thing in a game with guns. Man, I'm hungry. I'm not going to lie. I'm, like, chuffing. I'm hungry. I had breakfast too. Also, chuffing is not the word I wanted. I like achievements like this where you get one for exploring and doing random stuff. Yeah, man. If you don't steal from them, you're not going to get that achievement. Like uh, Sander Cohen, you take a picture of his dead body in Bioshock and you get the achievement. The Sealed Gate. You could never kill Sander Cohen. Well, before we do that, 
going to head back to the Izzity Arc. And, real quick, I'm going to go see if there's something quick I can, like, just grab to snack. Um, so, I'll be right back real quick. The only real quick thing I found was carrots, and I'm not going to eat that on stream. <laughs> I'm not going to crunch on stream like that. So I'll wait. I'll just eat later. I just got a Hollow Knight vibe from the music. That was weird. Wait, Hollow Knight was a game that I existed, that I played. Um, yep. It's weird to think about. You look thirsty. Have a seat. That's everything, man. I bought it all. Excelente. And I can now give everybody another uh, grenade. I have so many grenades. What do these do? Increases the chance of hitting a target. Oh, that's cool. I should have looked at that. Um, smoke. Whoops. I think I want... I think I just want a damage grenade. Got a bunch of hats that I'm not interested in. You don't really have anything new, I'm assuming. Also, the elder didn't Welcome. like call me out this time. If you want zone gear, I've got it. I don't really want zone gear. I want this. Okay. Safe travels. I uh, hope I don't use all those med kits, but now if I need them, I have them. Don't just stand there. You need a fix. All right, what do I want to do here? Probably upgrade this. Make it even better. Yeah. I assume these are our endgame guns. I could be wrong, but... We're pretty close to Eden, quote-unquote, and they're like Miramar um, guns, and Miramar, I assume, is like the weapons company or whatever, so I, I'm sort of banking on those being our endgame guns. If I get other guns that are better, uh, that will suck, because I won't be able to upgrade them, really. We're close, man. I don't even know if this is the end of the game. I know it's called Road to Eden, but I don't know if Eden is, like, our end game. Maybe we go to Eden, we fight our way through Eden, and somebody's like, No, the Ark is the bad guys, and then we go all the way back and fight our way back to the Ark or something. I mean, there's, there's many ways this could end doesn't have to be us getting to Eden and that ends the game. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm ready for whatever happens. I'm ready for it. We're close. But 
the Nova sect got here first. Stay alert. Have I fought? Holy ancients power. Oh, yeah, okay. I feel the gates breaking. Can I? The sacred numbers call to us. I was going to say, have I ever fought Nova sect like proper before? But yes, I have. I have. I've fought many of those. Words of Tritonia. We stand before the gates of Eden. Inside lies the sacred numbers. The numbers that awaken. Ooh, okay, we got a medbot, a pyro. Somebody who's talking that I can't see. That big boy. Woohoo! Ah. These are rough. This is a rough one. There was stuff over here. I'm assuming I can um, get this first. Also, I am trying to like see what is all around. I'm back for a bit waiting on my doctor. Nice. Stuff over there. Police. Break through the gates of Eden. The sacred numbers await us. The numbers, Mason. Oh, shoot. You cannot escape the that sucks. Hopefully I can do this without alerting everybody else. Requesting emergency assistance. That extra suck. That super sucks. This is going to get loud here. Not good. Oh no, I can shoot that person. That means they're in. Oh, everybody. Every. Everybody's here. Shh. I'm playing buffering the game because mobile data, so I'll be back. No worries. You do what you got to do. I need Borman. I, I need Borman back, like now. No chance to hit. Here comes everybody, huh? I don't know why that guy gave up the high ground, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know what I don't know what possessed him to do that move. He had high ground and he decided to move from it. Maybe nobody's heard us. Maybe I misjudged what was going on. Maybe nobody has heard this. Today, dick wife. She's got a monster crit chance, dude. What? Nobody heard that? Nobody heard that. Magnus just has an insane range. He can see and shoot at almost anybody. Well, at least within this area. 
Wow, I'm surprised by that. I was like, ah, oh, I triggered everybody. It's going to be a battle. All right, here we go. Just dug in for the long haul, but no. Work harder! Break the gates down! And find the sacred numbers! So this is it. The gates of Eden. The Nova Sect might have beat us here, but they can't get in. We still have a chance, but we have to stick to the shadows. Oh, dude, we got this. I loved an achievement in Div uh, Divinity Original Sin when you can only get the side quest if you had the ability to talk to animals, and then you can help a cat by talking to another cat and get them married. What? <laughs> That's... That's weird, I'm not gonna lie. That's, I mean, it's cool, but it's very weird. Gosh, there's so much going on. I just, I imagine this is gonna be a lot of stuff because it's close. I'm, again, I'm assuming this is close to the end of the game. I have all the, I've got all the artifacts. I've got these weapons that seem really, really good. That's a pyro, or that's a butcher and a tank. That's brother Mark Luther. That's a hunter. That's a hunter. I think what I'd like to do here is get all the way over to Mark Luther and, or Mark Luther, Luther, whatever his last name was. And, uh, Get, get into him first. Really lay into that guy. Divinity games are full of stuff like that. There's so many possibilities. He's only got two armor. He's only got two armor. I could kill him. This is going to trigger everybody, obviously, but I could very well kill this guy. I figured. I figured I wasn't going to stay sneaking for long. Oh, and you know what's great? Magnus's mind control is, is back. Because there's a bunch of... Uh, Organics, organic enemies. I haven't been able to use mind control in a minute because, you know, all the robos. Right. I got him! Yes. All right. That takes care of our biggest problem immediately. That guy is literally one square out from being able to stun him. That's very unfortunate. I'll try and take control of the guy with the high ground on my next turn, as long as he's still up there. Just kidding. <laughs> I'll still probably try and take control of that guy. Oh gosh, they've got really good weapons now too. Okay. Divinity game, you can sneak around before starting the fight and taking weapons off from corpses and skeletons. So when the battle begins and there was a necromancer present who could resurrect them, the skeletons have to go around looking for new weapons or just fight with their fists. Hey man, that's just smart. 
Nobody's in range? That sucks. That's just smart strategy. I'm actually not in the best place of all time. Um, no chance. No chance. But he can hit me? That doesn't make any sense. Oh my gosh, he's one turn out as well. They're all one move away. I got nothing. I'm going to throw a smoke grenade. Because that way we won't be shot. Like, they can't shoot us with the smoke grenade, so. If I can't do anything to them, I might as well keep my people safe, you know what I mean? Oh, dang, I can't get the pyro. I can't double up on any of these? All right, that's not worth it then. Overwatch. 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 Try filthy, filthy, you cut air! Percent shot. Let's go for it. Not gonna warn you again. Got him. I can get one or the other. I can get both. I can move Borman. If I move Borman here, he has a shot. But then so does the other people. So do the other people. And the, the, his shotgun won't kill. I don't really know what to do here with Borman. I guess I, it might kill. Nope, 50% chance. I could stun this guy, I guess. Okay, hang on. Actually, hang on. That's, we have a, I have an idea. What's my percentage on that one? Crap. What's my percentage here? 25? Not worth it. 50%? Um, not worth it. Grenade? This seems like a waste. Oh, there's a spot I can get both of them. So, yes. Because it'll kill the guy up top. It kills the guy up top, which means I can stun this guy without risking uh, getting shot. At least for now. I will get shot right here, but from the Overwatch. Oh, that hurts! Get that back one. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh. Nice! Fool! Yeah, fool. I mi I met uh wait. I hit him. I don't know how many times I hit him, but I did hit him. Um. Another one. 
Selma can finish off the tank. Yeah. Just be done with one of them. Borman might go down here. Okay, Borman went down. Sec tanks are the worst. Tanks are pretty not great. You're not wrong. Um, gonna take a shot at Borman. I'm gonna go out and live and say Borman is fine. We, I think we can end this before Borman has a chance to, to have an issue. of you actually nice of you to get closer and I knocked him out of cover all right Selma hey okay serves you right not a problem we're good it, I'm okay. I'm okay. it always worries me. Every time we end a fight with somebody down, it shows a skull where they are. Like, Borman was just a skull just now. And I was like, wait, no, he's not dead. And then it, it healed him. Every time, dude. I'm worried every time. Break down the gates. Tear them apart. Bring the sacred numbers to me! You are really all about the numbers, Mason. Okay. Our next idea, or our next thing is to, I guess, go get this last group. I don't see, I, I don't see, oh, there's a med pod. I don't see the talking woman, which I don't love. We have, I assume that's her. I assume that that person who I can't aim at is her. We have a med bot. We have a giant robot. We've got the pyro and we've got, I assume, whoever that is. How do I want to go about this is the question. High ground seems like a good idea. There's a lot of it. So what we're going to do. Nope. I guess this is useful. I can gather some information. That's a sect tank. That's not who's talking it. Oh, there's two more. Okay. There's two more that I didn't see. High Priestess Plutonia and Sect Hunter. Okay, so this is a bit different than I anticipated. So hang on. Remember those level 55 guys in the first area? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Alright, here's what I want to do. I'm going to split up the group. Or at least I'm going to split Magnus off from the group. I'm going to get Magnus up here. That way Magnus has a good line of sight on what we're doing. Right, and now I'm going to try and flank around. Here. Woo! 
Ah, stop that. Ugh. I want to try and flank around to High Priestess. Yeah, Plutonia. And uh, see if I can't start the fight with some good shots on her. I remembered I should go check on those guys in my game to see what they're guarding. Yeah, I probably should have done that, but oh well. Alright, so Borman is here. And now Selma does, I'm going to move Selma to the same spot. And Selma and Borman are going to both try and just absolutely go in on her. I assume she's, like, the worst, so I want to get her out of the way. And I have a, I have 10 med kits, so I can, um, if need be, I can eat damage pretty well. Alright, that's where I'm leaving them for now, and I'm going to go ahead and trigger ambush. Let's see what we got. Can I get a shot at her? No, I'm literally just blocked by this thing. Okay. So, we're not going to open with... Mm, we're going to open with Magnus, but we're going to open with Magnus in such a way that we take over... Pyro. Yeah? Is that what we're doing? Yes. Okay, so the Pyro is now mine. I'm gonna run him out in the open. I'm gonna chuck this. I can't get the tank in her, so I'll just get those two. Hopefully, hopefully, they attack him and he takes some shots for me. I guess I could have tried to stun her. That probably would have been a better idea. I can always do it next turn. Oh, she caught them. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna go and try and get some rest, have a good time with the game. Yo, Estonian, thank you, man. I will uh, do my best. I will absolutely do my best. Okay, that hurt her a lot. Oh, what the heck? Die, you unholy corruptors. Estonian, you sleep well, dude. Hopefully you get some nice rest. Oh, nice. Borman didn't take any damage. She just tried to mind control him, I think, and I have the anti-mind control on him, so. Good mark. Shoot your friend! God, this is a lot. Okay. If I if I fail this, I know how I'm gonna do it differently next time. I know what I'll change next time if I should fail this. Yeah, hi, why are you here? He missed a 75, he missed. Night is Tony. Okay, we did that. Start with Selma. I want to kill her. That's really what I want. 
I think Borman can get her if he hits. If he hits, I think he can get it. She can die right now. Okay. But it ends to Plutonia's plans. But now the problem becomes him. He's going to revive Plutonia. Why'd you do that? Ow. I'm gonna smash him. Yes, that's what I really wanted. I wanted them to attack each other. Also, 15 damage. Um, okay. Target priorities, man. How are we doing this? I need to get rid of the med bot. I have to get rid of the med bot, and I have to get rid of the robot. Can provider on approach vector. Can I knock him down? Is that a thing? <gasps> I can. Yeah. Okay, med bot taken care of for now. Selma's got nothing. Selma's in a terrible place. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have Selma eat a med kit. And then I'm gonna have her shoot the big boy. This is our this is our target. The two robots are our target priorities right now. The tank sucks, but it's not so bad. And the hunter sucks as well, but it's not so bad. I got it. That frickin' stinks. This thing, on the other hand, will really hurt me if it gets up. And this will really take away my... Ruin my whole kill if it gets up. Selma might. Selma might die here. We'll see what happens. This guy missed twice. All right, that's a gift. That's a gift. Will we kill the med bot? No. I have to take a turn to have us both attack it. So I'm gonna heal Borman. And then I'm gonna fire at the med bot. And then I'm gonna have to have Magnus also shoot it. No med bot. Some of the med bot. Okay, that's awesome, actually. He's closer to me now. Selma, Selma's still alive. I think she's actually gonna get up this turn, if I'm not mistaken. Oh boy, okay. Gotta kill that thing now. Gotta get rid of it now. Do I go for the auto crit? No, I don't wanna miss. He critted anyway. Okay. Selma, you are in a bad spot, girl. Uh, Borman reload. Borman, kill that thing. Okay, no more of that. No more of that guy. Selma, you're gonna need to heal yourself. And reload, probably. I need to move her as well. I'd rather move her, I think. She can reload next turn. Hey, video! Video, thank you for the six bitties. Video, thank you for the six more bitties and the six more bitties. Thank you for the hostile takeover of my event list. Appreciate that, man. How you doing today, dude?
Video, what's going on, man? How you doing? I got him. That was awesome. Ooh, um, okay. I'm gonna do this then. I missed. Unfortunate, okay, heal. Yeah, go after the tank. That'll kill him. I'm gonna try and Stardew Valley Ranch. Or Stardew Valley slash Ram Ranch in real life. Yo! What does that look like? What would that look like for you? Hey, video. We did it! Oh my, I thought that could have been so much worse. That should have probably been so much worse than it was. Oh! And that is that. Arc 1. Nova Sect Zero. Their insane plans to destroy our home vanish into the wind. We're safe. Our people live another day. The smoke clears. Ears still ringing. On the edge of my blurred vision, something comes out of the arc. Light dancing across my arm, up my face. I look up. I'm being scanned by some giant eyeball. Then Dux and Pharaoh get scanned. Then Magnus and Selma. The light cuts out and the eyeball darts back inside the wall. We hear pistons churning, gears turning. A machine humming back to life. The gates of Eden open. Maybe Eden sees we're mutants and welcomes us home. We stand there in silence. The five of us are all mutants, found and raised by the Elder. This feels like an answer to the question that's plagued our lives. Who are we? And do we go in and find out? When Ducks and me first started out, everything was cut and dried. The Elder knew best. There were no answers in the zone. Mutants didn't know who they were, where they came from. And that was fine. No one cared. But now, after the enemies we fought, after the friends we found, after all we've seen, the five of us stand here at the gates of Eden. Do we go in? Do we want to know who we are? I don't know, man. Do you? It is done. Now, let's see what hides behind that gate. Interesting. I have three crops growing inside. Once it warms up, I'm going to start a massive garden. Nice. Well, before we go in there. Before we go in and see what is awaiting us. We are going to, uh... Get all the stuff we earned in our battle, first and foremost. Gonna grab all the loot. Let's split up. Cause there is loot to be had. And if I'm anything, I am a gamer who likes loot. Oh, also, there's stuff back here that I haven't been able to look at. Or, no, I did look at this, actually. Gamer! Oh, it's snowing again. God dang it. I just looked out my window. Well, 
All right. Alrighty. Well, let's get in here and see what Eden has to offer. Shall we? Shall we? What answers lie within Eden? Don't say it's snowing. That means it's going to come over here. I'm sorry, video. It's snowing. It's actually snowing pretty decently hard, too, unfortunately. I can see it already, like, accumulating on the pine tree next to my house. I can only give you the facts. I'm sorry. I mean, I could lie to you and say there's no snow, but then that would be irresponsible of me. Reach Eden. We did it. New location discovered Eden. All right, what lies in here? That's the same star we saw on those flying machines. The machines did come from here. Hammond was right. What monstrosities lie within here? I knew this med pack was going to be here. I know this. Evacuation orders have been given and a destruction order has been issued for all research, including the healthy biological subjects. Upset a number of us, not just for ethical reasons, but for the sheer loss of what we accomplish. The news has hit Ingmar pretty particularly badly. Locked himself in the birthing chamber with the subjects and refuses to open the door. I ate four medkits in that fight. This is an intense fight. Eden D's burgers. Oh my gosh. I want a burger now. All right, so that was that hallway. It's over here. Ooh, pretty. You're red. Oh, is that where the thing from, is that where the goop ball from inside was kept? They're inside and mutant year zero in the same universe. Command is in a state of total panic following the loss of orbital Z1. A order has been issued to return all militarized bots and equipment directly to unit Theta. My suspicions are confirmed and without a shadow of a doubt, we are at war. I can only hope that it is quick, regardless of who wins. Interesting. Alright, there's only one more passage to go down. Let's walk the path. Shall we? Very blue. I don't know why it's so blue. More oh! Machines. All unbroken. But quiet. Oh. Are they asleep? I don't think I could fight all of these, I'm gonna be honest. As strong as I am, I'm not sure I could take six of them. This is it. I don't know why the Elder kept us away from this place. But I think we're about to find we out. We found the cool blue, and now we're in the, the the deep red. Red means scary, right? It is a tense and dreadful time, and we have heard whispers that the peace talks have broken down irreparably. To confirm this somewhat, Command has just ordered us to consider Elysium as hostile, and to forcibly remove, if necessary, any Elysium diplomats and scientists from the facility. This is a sad day for all of us. Oh. Why, hello there. I don't believe it. I can't believe it. That's somewhere I've been before. That was like the beginning of the game. Unreal. Wow. The tree and grass. Just like outside. Ow! 
Is that supposed to be like that? Ow. Stop doing that. Ow. I think it's supposed to do that. Ow. Ah. Oh. My gosh, that was awful. I hate that. A lot, actually. This place is messing with my head. This can't be a picture of me, right? No, it probably can be. Probably your home, dude. All right, well, prepare your ears for this. Ow! What's going on? We're uh, finding out the truth, but the truth comes with pain in the ear holes. Truth, truth comes with ear splitting pain. That is a really bad noise. Regression of in skeletal mass against soft tissue mass. Oh my gosh. Um, and passerine birds, rodents, gray diamonds, and bats. Raw data is in the electric supplementary material to the mass of the mammal skeletons. 15% was added to account for the fact that mammal bones are not uh, mandicized but contain marrow, regression slopes do not differ significantly. Comparison to skeleton masses uses analysis of convariance demonstrated that the mass of bird skeletons is indistinguishable from that of rodents. Okay. The sound. I don't know what that sound is, dude. I, I hate it, though. I don't know what that sound was, but I do hate it. All this time we're talking about skeletons that don't look like us. This one kind of does. There might have been mutants in Eden. Alrighty. Oh, dude, it's ducks. You see that? Should I get ducks out here to see that? Probably, right? I'm gonna switch out uh, Magnus real quick for ducks. Just put it, I'll put him right back, but. The data yielded a maximum likelihood of 0 0.2 PNG for two haliopotypes, combining a C on one hand and a Y and a two on the other. Uh, and of the zero when all four haplites were examined, 95% confidence interval for PNG was 0 0.83 for two haplites. This is just nonsense. For four haplites, the two, uh, blah, blah, blah. It's just nonsense. I can read it, but it means nothing to me. It's just science mumbo jumbo that means nothing to me. I could read it, but I wouldn't understand it. Oh, while I have ducks, I guess I can do this. The big words. Oh, yes. The big words are not my friends. Squish a puss. Or platypus, if you prefer. A lot of tanks, a lot of empty tanks. There's nothing in this room? What? Are you for real? Nothing to investigate? Nothing to read? Really? Look, the screen with the lights. If we want to 
answers. That's a good place to start. Sure, man. Give it to me. Whatever it is. Whatever's we going on. Huddle around the screen. The words Mutant Project Blink on and off in big red letters. The screen turns black, then explodes with a flurry of flashing images faster than we can take in. I catch glimpses of mutants in test tubes, animals in cages, strands of code, something called DNA. The screen freezes on one final image. An employee profile. A scientist of the mutant project. It says his name is Ingmar Edison. His face. When we see his face, those eyes staring back at us, we couldn't believe it. It was him. The profile says his status was revoked after stealing mutant experiments from the lab. Memories come flooding back. We were the experiments. They raised us in tubes and played games with our DNA made us freaks the elder was part of this happy endings died with the ancients why didn't he tell us who is he the room spins the truth comes flooding back into my brain everything i know is a lie i lose my balance as the room turns black a voice crackles onto the radio Ghost-like, ethereal, like the ancients call it down from space. Command Center Sweden. Coming, Command Center Sweden. I repeat, Command Center Sweden. Command Center Sweden. Coming, Command Center Sweden. I repeat. Oh, that's it? That's how it ends? Gotta set up those sequels. That's how it ends. Really? Huh. What a crappy ending. I mean, it's an ending. Very um, unsatisfying one, but it is an ending, I guess. That was, I mean, I really liked the game. I just want to be clear. I really enjoyed this. I liked it a lot. I might play this again on my own. I liked it so much. But uh, the story was kind of like predictable saw that coming uh, another groundbreak another groundbreaking obviously uh, but fun very fun game really enjoyed it really like it That was worse than that other game. It's just clickbait. <laughs> Gotta set up those sequels, dude. Well, you guys have been here with me. Uh, you know that we watch credits. If you've never been here, uh, we watch credits. So we will we'll sit here and watch the credits. Tag yourself. Uh, I'm Alexander Numa Numen Numenok. Numenok. If I could say it, I could tag myself. Again, really fun. Really enjoyed it. Really liked it. Just a bit of a disappointing ending. I'm that guy with four names. Oh, dude, Altair Lane. That's cool. People got cool. People got some cool names, dude. 
Like that name is awesome. What is that? Kurilo? That's a cool name. Elise Baptiste, that's a cool name. I've never been here before. How do credits work? Uh, we sit here and watch them scroll by. Although the music has ended. And now we are left in the silence of the credits. Which is odd. But okay. I see the scroll thing. I assume that means I can like make them go faster. I guess I'll do that. <laughs> Since we're sitting in silence, I guess I'll scroll them by a little quicker. Yeah, really, really did like that, though. It was fun. It was a very fun game. I like that it um, had a little more nuance to it than XCOM did, and that you can stealth. And uh, ambushes are... Ambushes feel way more effective in this. Also, there's a lot more exploration. Very much more um, freedom to go exploring around. I guess that's the credits. I like them both. I like this. I like XCOM. I liked Mario and Rabbids. I like these type of games. You know what I mean? So, it was a fun game. Oh, yep, there's nothing nothing else. We don't know how they work, but we watch them. Next game's Alan Wake. Ha! <laughs> he got jokes. Funny guy. Got jokes. Uh, I don't know what the next game's going to be. Honestly. Mario and Rabbids. So yeah, guys, I actually don't have another game. I didn't think we would beat this so quickly. I don't really have another game ready to go. So I guess that's the stream. Sorry about that. That's my fault for not being prepared. I thought we had a lot more. I thought we had hours left in this. But uh, yeah, tomorrow we're going to start something new because we beat Mad Max. Tomorrow we'll start a new Saturday game because we beat Mad Max. And... Sunday, uh, D and D comes back, which is nice. But yeah, Garfield cart. Did the hog guy always have to be in the party? No, I could take him out. I I took him out at one point just to see some things. Um. But yeah, he did seem like the main character. I am curious if I had not had him in the party and I had been somebody else, if somebody else would have been our narrator. I doubt it. I doubt it, but uh, that would be an interesting thing. Yes. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you for being here with me when you could have been anywhere else in the entire world. It means a lot to me. Sorry that this is ending so I really was unprepared for this to end so quickly. Um, but otherwise, stay awesome, everybody. And bye-bye now.